What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Let Their Fly YouTube channel. Today, we got 650 versus 650, and we're gonna do a little bit more true of a test this time. Yeah. So, last time we had these guys out, we, uh, I had 32 inch tires, or almost 33 inch actually, me measured, but yep. put my XM310s on, which are more of a mud tire than the Moto Havocs. Yes, they are. Better yes, they are. I'm gonna give up a little bit of ground clearance now, but. Oh, all right, all right. So I'm still stretched. Yeah, you're no, still you're stretched. Still... Yeah. Now what about the other 650? So, just for shits and giggles, I can't took really my, see because of the glare. I took my Tarachis off of the 850 because I wanted to see how the 650 would do with them, and Marshall never ran them. So never had a chance yet. I threw them on the white squad, and da -da -da -da. this isn't a video for this yet, but but Nova Winch came and sent us some winches. They uh, they want to see if we can break them. They want us to test them out. We are gonna do a review of these winches for you guys. Not this ride, but you never know. We might we might start testing it today. <laughs> and one cool thing about it too, still working on some details, but one of you is gonna be getting another winch. Uh-huh. So if you guys are getting stuck and burying your crap, you take might want to take pictures, because I think we're gonna do whoever's got the best picture or the worst stuck quad. Yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna send out a winch. We'll probably be creating an email just for that competition, um, just for the giveaway. But all right, so right now we're gonna gear up and hit the mud. All right, guys, we're back at it in our normal ride location. So yeah, I threw the XM 310s back on because I want to see how these guys do now. Um, especially since last time we came down to the swamp, it was very soft, non-grippable mud, and this has more of a paddle design to it as opposed to the. Uh, Moto Havoc, so I'm hoping that it's gonna make it this way. She uh, propels through the water a little bit. That's the, the hopes, at least. I want to put the trotches on, so I want to see how they actually did on the 650. And the 650 did fine with the cryptids. gonna go for the straight hole. I'll go for the one I'm probably gonna get stuck in. Can make sure. a look oh, dude, get the halos on. What are you doing? Uh, Bad Astrid. The there halo? she is. Yeah, there you go. All right. All right, wanna just go straight through and see how she does? Let's see. It. I got a good angle. You definitely got the RPM over me. Yeah. You got stuck there last time. Man, I don't even know if Melissa's about to make it back here ever again. Oh man, we let this girl in. It's all rough. Oh, crash now. Seth and his Tarachis, he loves them. I do. Get it? Okay. Now I'm gonna go Ooh. through this hole, which is I know gonna be death, but I'm hoping the XMs work a little better than the uh, Moto Havocs. Find out right now. Oh, dude, this clutching is not happy. That's that damn tree. She's really thick. If I'm able to back up. A little longer than a few minutes later. <laughs> One week later. All right, I'm gonna give her a send here. Do it.
you go, so keep going. Thick. She's really thick. An axle hop on me. Don't an axle hop on me. Back her up a little bit. Push out my other clutching. There you go, there you go, there you go. Stay on her. Stay on her. Nice. It's even thick right here, dude. That's what I'm saying. She is thick. Dang, guys. This is why I want to put these tires on because at least he's gripping it. But man, she's bogging her pretty hard and it doesn't help my... All right, I'll tell them. There's an STM primary clutch in there right now. And it turns out 650s and 570s don't like the STMs. Well, that's what you've read. I can't get the RPM out of it right now. Um, I've tried, it's got no weight in it literally right now. Yeah, I don't and, know. And um, I'm gonna try doing a primary spring change because the secondary is set up really good right now. So um, I'm gonna try doing that and see if I can get to a little higher higher uh, revving and see if I can get it to dig a little more. Yeah, I mean. But right now she's bogged. She only hits like 7,100 RPM. Worst case scenario, I'll take it off your hands maybe for the 850. Yeah, but I might need it for a certain project. Oh, uh, that's true. <laughs> Sooner or later. That is true. All right, let's see how this bad boy's looking today. That's where I knew I was getting stuck. You got it drawing. The hard part is maintaining your speed around the turn. Be able to climb up that. Well, my hard part is ground clearance. Oh yeah, that's the only thing I got going on you right now. Now I climb up on. I have four tires off the ground basically. Well, some idiot with like 32 inch. <laughs> Where'd you go? I saw you disappear. I, I stepped off the log by accident. Some idiot came through here with 32 inch moto hats. I don't know what the heck was that. And over there, freaking chewing it all up. It's all trench now. Yeah, it is. Freaking jerk. Big time trench up. All right, let's see if uh, my 650 decides to make it with the XMs and Elkus. Yeah. This is that giant hump right in the middle. Yeah, dude, all four of my tires were like kind of teetery. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm trying to hit it with some speed. Yeah. Might be able to ride up it. I feel the need, the need for speed. Let's go. Yeah. Dang. Your tires came clean off the ground. Oh, I feel it. I'll try one more time here. I don't think I'm gonna get it though. Yeah, I don't know if getting getting in is gonna happen here or getting out of this one. I don't think so. I was surprised the Trachis made it all the way around on the first run. I was pretty happy with that. Yeah. <laughs> it's just a wedge, and there's like. Well, it's not nothing to do with it, either the tires or the machines. Dude, my a arms are really clearance. hitting. It is all ground clearance. Let's 
kind of like a little mini skeg. It was. <laughs> Alright guys, so Seth's going to try going backwards through the swamp here. See what happens. This is going to be the, this is the clean out run, officially. Backwards, we've never done this. Pretty fine. Basically, right now you have the same setup as your 850, just just a power. little less ground clearance and, and power. power. I got a set of boxes. Yeah, move too fast, right? And we'll give it to set. This is the clean out run, so. Ah, you bastard! Oh, dude, I've been getting eaten alive the whole time right here. Come this over here. Relax. What am I on? down there. Get tired. Tree here that I don't remember? Probably. It's buried. How you doing there? And that's I might tap just because I'm tired. I crash. I hit the tree. Hope it didn't land in the water. Oh, it's in the water. She's in the water. I toasted her, guys. Camera's doing things by itself now. Just gonna shut it off here. All right. Set to the clean out run. See what I do now. Oh, it really stinks here. Alright, so, uh. <laughs> my clean out run through this really sucked bad. Not gonna lie. I'm still exhausted from it. <laughs> Come on. What's that side? 
If you see the camera jerking, it's some swatting deer flies. Since I'm on a spree of breaking stuff, guys, it swamps the drone. Might as well snap an axle. Let's just We're do good. it. That is so deep on one side. Oh my goodness. This rough is so bad over here now. They got soupy over here. Get your Nova winch. Nova winch time. These winches are fast. Have you noticed that? Good. Good. All right, so Seth right now, he's just gearing back up. He's gonna hit the swamp one more time before we head out and hit a couple more spots. But um, yeah, he cleared it out first, so that's why he took forever. But uh, he wants his redemption run to show how fast he can actually go through. Those ruts are getting so bad now. Close. <laughs> Oh. He's 
I watched a belt and take still on that thing. He doesn't doesn't have the CBT raised up. He's got her. Grass is so high, I can just see the Seth. <laughs> Hey, he just got stuck in the same spot I did. He's putting in two wheel. Deep spot, not that deep, but deep enough to help clean the quad off a little it's bit. Definitely deep enough. It's got a, a deep in, in and out. Yes, and there's a log at the end. Nice. I just lost it. I have no idea where it is. Go out of the way, log. Oh, there's fish in here, dude. This water's not even cool. It is very warm actually. There's tons of fish in here. And deer flies. What? Lost my headset. Gone intermittent. Huh? I don't hear it anymore. I know, I said to power off. Oh. Forgot to charge my intercom last night, guys. All right, we're gonna see if we can get some water wheelie in on the other end. This side you can't really do because there's a giant rock here and there. Oh, there's a big snapper from last time. Hey, buddy. Hey, he's moving out of the way. He's right in there somewhere else. Don't hit my foot wherever you are, buddy. Is that him right there? There he is. That's a hell of a stick. He's making his way downtown. I'll let him move out of the way first. Don't want to get bit in the foot. That'd be an interesting call too. Wow, he's a big boy. Look at you. Oh, wow. My man is large and in charge. Okay. Oh. Wait for our buddy to move. What's that? He's like that big around. What, a snapper? Yeah. <laughs> hey, spider, get the fuck out of here. They're a big boy. Stay over there, buddy. Really? I would crawl this up sideways. Gotta go that way. You get stuck on that log. That big ass fucking log. 
I'm not gonna lie, I washed myself off in this water. It's just some nasty smelling water. It's all algae. <laughs> all right, so had some fun in the deeper water here. Now we're gonna go try to find a spot we haven't hit in a long time since winter, I don't think. Uh, yeah, something like that. Yeah, but um, it's kind of the edge of the property where that guy kind of yelled at us. But that's okay. Oh god. Where was the trail even at? All right, so there's some serious I'm going ruts for. through here. <laughs> yeah, there's some really bad ruts. Oh my god. I was bottomed out in the 850. Oh, I'm scraping bottom dude right now. Yeah, except you got more oh, ground clearance. No. Oh shit. I don't even have anything to winch to either. You got a big tree in front of you. Where? Look straight ahead. There? That monster. That? Yeah. It fell. No, the one that's standing up. Right there. Yeah. That's a, yeah, you have you have a freaking 70 foot rope? Putting that Nova winch to work. Who That's knew we were gonna test the Nova winch so much today? Yeah. Uh, uh. Nice. You better pin that because those tires are clogged. Here we go. Travel for the win. Let's see what I can do. Just pin it. Woo. You got it. You can feel it just dragging bottom the whole way. <laughs> oh yeah. Nice. This shouldn't be too bad here. Famous last words. Coming out is always the hard part, not going in. So thin down, oh this looks sick here. That's niggish. Let's see what's over here real quick. Deep area to the left. Ah, let's see what's over here. It's been so long, oh my god. This is usually water, oh my goodness. Yeah, it's, it's thick, dude. There's a tree down over here. This is just recently flooded. It actually goes around the tree in the stream now. Dry up a little bit. This dried up a lot. 
like well, that. I was saying if it dried up more, it'd be like. Yeah, there's Muck a lot city. of trees though. They can cut through there actually. Well, yeah, this is very low now. Is it? There's oh. like nothing in this little pocket over here. Tree down in it. Holy crap! This used to be like three feet deep. I right know. It's pretty mucky though. It smells like crap. Ugh. Oh, sure it does. Guess we'll work our way over to the stream. I guess so. If we can find it. All right, we just got back to the house here. Uh, yeah, it's hot out, and that's why we're staying in the shade. So if it's hard to see us, apologies. Right. <laughs> but I gotta say, now that you put these on the 650, the Tarachis, the XMs. Run pretty close to the Trachis, I think, as far as how they performed. Yeah, uh, they performed pretty similar. Um, the one thing I do still like about the Tarachis over the XMs is you can spin them at a slower. Yeah, speed. they did clean out a little easier. Um, but other than that, I mean, they're damn near the same size. I mean, I'm not giving up much um, tire height. I'm giving up quite a bit of ground clearance. Yeah, I, I had the ride height advantage um, on him because I had the Elkos on, so helps keep her kind of lifted. Yeah, it looks more. like she's a good inch and a half, maybe two um, higher. So, you know, they both performed really well uh, again. And a Nova winch so far. Didn't know we weren't planning on using it. <laughs> Nova winch worked. Nova winch worked. So uh, next video you guys probably see, we're gonna be doing a review of that and we are gonna be getting very stuck on purpose, unfortunately. Seth's face is might, showing his excitement already. I, I might have to ride in shorts. The winters <laughs> are just too hot. No, it, we're, we want to make sure these the winches work so i mean there's only one way to put them to the test and that's to yeah i mean literally the guy sent us an email said do you think you can break this winch that was his first line yeah I was of like, the email it's like oh i guess we'll probably find out. all right guys so with that make sure you guys are liking subscribing and commenting down below we really appreciate all the support you guys give us and seth where can they find us on interwebs you can find us on facebook TikTok, and instagram reach out shoot us a message um we always respond to them all right we will catch you later on Next Dirt Fly. What? Next Dirt Fly? Yes. All right, we'll catch you next time on Let Dirt Fly. Hey.